Earlier this week, over $54 million in tax refunds and earned income tax credit checks were sent in the mail for over 25,000 taxpayers. It's a, a big relief for, for um, the department as well as DOA. Reverend Tax Director John Camacho says the latest payment covers all error-free returns filed up to the April 15th filing deadline. This batch represents just a portion of what was paid for fiscal year 2015. We're up to about 1, 140, 147, I believe, in, in paying our refunds for the fiscal year. So every year the governor has, has made a commitment that uh, you know to, to get those uh, refunds out as early as possible. And, and, uh, and you know, basically we're, con we're continuing to process returns and we'll be getting most of the returns uh, going out, you know, most hopefully in a weekly basis. Of that total count for FY15, $121 million was paid for individual refunds and $6.7 million for businesses. For the individual refunds, exactly 56,831 checks were issued in FY15, about 46,000 of which was for tax year 2014 alone. Refunds were even paid for tax years 2005 to 2013, totaling about $20 million worth. There was even one refund paid in the amount of $351.51 for tax year 1995. And if you were expecting a check but didn't receive one or only saw a small amount, there's a chance it may have been garnished as a result of past due balances. If you know a person owes, uh, for example, GMH or public health or, or child support, uh, those will be offset to, to those uh, agencies. For this past fiscal year, there was $18.3 million in offsets. Among the areas where offsets occur include if you owe for gross receipt taxes or real property taxes, child support, the Guam Memorial Hospital, public health, and GURA. For example, with GURA, Executive Director Michael Duenia says since 2012, GURA has received over $345,000 from tax offsets. This fiscal year, they received over $8,400 and expect an additional $18,000 from the most recent release. The hospital, meanwhile, represents a bigger chunk of the offsets. GMH management tell KUAM that from the start of FY15, GMH has received $7.3 million so far in offsets. However, that's minimal compared to the listing GMH has sent Revintax in outstanding balances since June. That totals around $116 million. With the latest batch, GMH expects somewhere around $3 million. These don't include people who are current with payment plans. In the meantime, Camacho says some people have already inquired about problems with their refunds. If, if, if you haven't received your fund, you know, please come and visit our, our department. We, we'll be happy to, to uh, trace you know, your, your return. And, and, and if there's any problem, we'll try and, and, and uh, fix those problems for the taxpayers. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Ken Quintaniza.